would you build a weapon capable of destroying the planet? Two scientists argued exactly that. The year was 1945. World War II ended in the shadow of the atomic bomb, Oppenheimer's creation. But Edward Teller had a new idea, an even more powerful weapon, the hydrogen bomb. Oppenheimer resisted. He warned it would cross a moral line, unleashing limitless destruction. Teller disagreed. He argued America needed the H-bomb for defense in a Cold War already beginning. At secret meetings, their clash grew sharper. Oppenheimer, the cautious visionary. Teller, the relentless advocate. By 1952, Teller's design was tested, and it worked. A blast a thousand times stronger than Hiroshima. Oppenheimer's warnings were ignored. He soon lost influence, even his security clearance. Teller became known as the father of the H-bomb. Opposedly, Oppenheimer as the man who questioned power itself. The debate wasn't just about weapons. It was about whether science should prioritize conscience or survival. That question is still relevant today.